321, huh? Wow, shit. March is going right by pretty quick too. Spring has sprung, motherfuckers. It's here. Kind of ice right here, but it's all water out there. Eh, high 60s today. I'll take it. That's spring, baby. The season has begun. Out and about with the uh, new backpack today. First time taking it out. Everything all strapped on. All I took was the, uh, the ADD, a couple lenses, the mini tripods, and the drone. That's it. It's plenty heavy enough. <laughs> First real spring day we had. And I'm just out here in a thin shirt. So a little bit on the chilly side. Not too bad, though. Some nice light out right here, actually. It's getting nice and filtered by the trees behind me. Very photogenic light. I just wish I had something to photograph in it now. I'd be all set. <laughs> sit and wait, sit and wait. Name of the game. I just had two ducks flew in over that way. They're behind the grass, so I can't see them right now, but there's nowhere to really go over there, so they're probably gonna be working their way out in front of me here eventually, so I'm getting ready. They might just be chilling out in that grass over there just so I can't see them. <laughs> Little fucking bastards. Finally got them fucking mallards. Been waiting so long. I was like totally, totally getting ready to go find another spot. Just sitting here having a smoke, contemplating, yeah, I gotta go freaking move camp. I'm like, I gotta go change position here. Who comes floating right out in front of me? Fucking male and female mallard. Light hitting them freaking beautifully. They were like so close too. I didn't even have the camera in my damn hand. So I slowly turned around, all nonchalant, grabbed the camera, turned around, just started firing as much, getting as many as I could in before I spooked them. But eventually I did spook them. But I got quite a few shots in first, so I got them. Now I can change positions because there's definitely nothing over here now. <laughs> oh yeah. Daddy's favorite spot. Let's see which way we go in here. Just a nice Ooh, it's fucking slick underneath, too. Ooh. Switch hands, grab a new tree. Man, I was actually kind of treacherous through there. <laughs> it just looked like thin ice, but it was like really frozen underneath. Uh, that's that same hair and flying away. He'll be back. They always come back. There's some dry land. <laughs> Not much. A little bit. Some yummy looking swamp back there. Delicious. Nice froth on there. There's a beaver. There's a beaver right there. Go past the grass humps. See if I can get him to splash. Uh, there's a couple Canadians sitting like right out straight in front of me. It's a beautiful light. I gotta hit them. Hold on. Gotta get them. Gotta get these Canadians. Gotta get these Canadians. <laughs> There's the beaver. <laughs> What's up, dude? I see you. I see you, beaver. Ain't no escape. No escape. Slap that tail. I went under. Let's go stalk that beaver. You see he's all tough and shit. Ah, oh, he did it behind those freaking grass mounds. 
That wasn't intimidating. I'm not scared of that. Come on. He wants to go over to Beaver Beach, just like I want to go over to Beaver Beach. <laughs> Mr. Beaver. He's like, fuck this guy, he's not afraid of me. Slapping my tail for nothing. Look at that out of here. Come on. Oh, thank you. That was fucking sweet. <laughs> yes. That was fucking awesome. He's still out there too. He just went under. There's my Canadians. They're still floating around. They don't give a shit. They love getting their picture taken. So yeah, I'm getting to Beaver Beach before he does. And that's gonna piss him off good. There he is, straight out in front. Come on, do it again, bro. Come on. Need you at its finest, man. Come on. Alpha Beaver. Alpha Beaver. Show him who's the boss. Come on. <laughs> I fucking love that. Oh, that was so worth going out for. Just those today alone was just worth the hike out here. Oh, yeah, we got some nice, beautiful fucking light going right now. I'm gonna set up camp. These alpha beavers all pissed off. Herons haven't come back yet. Spooked him when I first got in here. But we're in a good position. We got a good amount of light stretching all across. We got pretty much good light. You know, I got some light over this way a little bit, but all throughout here, we got decent light up to about here because this big old tree in front of me. Not too much on the ground here in front of me though. These kind of are in shadows, no good light on them. But I've got some rocks and some stumps and some little trees out there that got some decent light on them. Then we got, of course, the nests out there. Yeah, I'm so happy about that beaver. That was awesome. That's nature saying, welcome back, motherfucker. <laughs> yeah, sun's going down. Temperature's dropping again. It's no longer spring. Slipping back into winter. Not really much going on out there. The beaver just came back. I just saw him a second ago. But, yeah, it's about time for me to get out of here. He's getting pretty active, actually. <laughs> a couple more minutes, I ain't gonna have any light to catch anything anyway, so... I was thinking about breaking the drone out, but uh, I don't feel like going through all that. I'm pretty exhausted. I'll probably crash the fucking thing into the pond. <laughs> I don't feel like doing that right now. It's the only thing I don't like about that drone is it takes so damn long to set it up and break it down. It's a very big inconvenience. Any drone convenience. I'm, I've been working on drone convenience. I'm going to show you all my drone convenience I bought. I have more drone convenience coming. Yes, the ultimate in drone convenience. <laughs> just sitting here, I fucking look up, a juvenile bald eagle comes flying in. Just got about fucking 100 shots of him flying all over the place. I think he's like sitting over in a freaking tree over here somewhere. Oh yeah, I got some good shots of him too. It's a good day. <laughs> Got alpha beaver splashing twice. Got fucking juvenile bald eagle. He's got the heron flying in again. Yeah, that thing was sweet. He fucking came out. He just flew over. I thought I was about to lose him. Seen the heron coming in. I thought it was another one. And he went down and he was flying like right over the damn water. Oh, I wish I got a shot of that. He didn't have the light on him though, so it kind of would have sucked. That was fucking cool. <laughs> yeah, he's still sitting in that same tree. All right, yeah, it's getting cold. The light is like going really fast now, so I gotta get the fuck out of here because it's gonna be even darker in the woods, so I gotta get packed up. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. Leave me a comment. Tell me I suck. Give me a thumbs up. And I'll catch you in the next vlog. Later.